Welcome to race 14 of season 2 in the Mountain Dew Cup series. We're at Martinsville Speedway today to see who will win the second to last race of season 2. In the point standings, the 45 of Tyler Reddick has the lead, but the 6 of Brad Kozlowski is closing in on him. Here are your songs for today and the rest of the season. In here race number 1, it's going to be Chris Buescher, Eric Amarola, Tyler Reddick, Austin Sindrick, Harrison Byrne, and Kyle Busch. Your points leader in the 45 is in this group. Eric Amarola is out to the lead, and Amarola will lead lot number one. As both your points leader Tyler Reddick and Kyle Busch go in the wall, that is not good for him. Already off to a rough start here for Tyler Reddick, two laps to go. Sindrick is going to take the lead away this time. And Sindrick's going to spin into the wall. He will still lead lap number two, though, as Eric Amarola falls back to second. And now the 45 car falls back to last place. This is disastrous for him. One lap to go. Eric Amarola is going to take the lead back away from Sindrick. And Eric Amarola will win here race number one. Sindrick in second will advance along with him. The 45 car once again finishes six. He only collects four points. That is very bad. In here race number two, it's going to be Chris Bell, Ryan Priest, Daniel Suarez, Corey LaJoy, Martin Truex Jr., and Todd Gillen. Looks like Corey LaJoy in the seven is going to have the lead this time, but he goes in the wall, and Chris Bell will now lead lap number one with the 41 of Priest in second. That costed Corey LaJoy a bunch of spots. Two laps to go. Truex out to a huge lead this time over his JGR teammate, but he goes in the wall. Truex is in the catch vent. We have cars flipping all over the place as we have two laying on the front stretch. Daniel Soares slides across the line on his roof, but Martin Truex Jr. will DNF. The third race in a row where we've seen a catch fence wreck. One lap remaining as Christopher Bell and Corey LaJoy are side by side. And Christopher Bell will win here race number two. Corey LaJoy will advance along with him as Truex will DNF once again. LaJoy has went from being an underdog to a top 10 contender week after week. Now in here race number three, it's going to be Austin Dillon, Kyle Larson, Adrian Allender, Noah Gregson, William Byron, and Ricky Stamps Jr. It's going to be Kyle Larson in the five with the lead. And here comes the rest of the field. They're side by side coming to the line. Looks like Larson got it. Austin Dillon second and Adrian Almendar in third. Two laps to go for he race number three. William Byron with the lead this time as Austin Dillon's off the pace. And Byron will lead lap number two. Larson falls back to second. And Austin Dillon goes from second to six. That is very bad for him. One lap to go. Stenhouse out of nowhere takes the lead away this time. He's side by side with Larson, and Stenhouse will lead the final lap to win. He raced number three. Kyle Larson in second will advance along with him. What a surprise. He came out of nowhere. Now in here race number four, it's going to be Brad Kozlowski, Ross Chastain, Ryan Blaney, Eric Jones, Denny Hamlin, and Kevin Harvick. This is going to be an interesting group. Looks like Harvick on the inside is going to have the lead. Kozlowski takes it back, and Kozlowski will lead lap number one. Ryan Blaney in second and Eric Jones in third. How about that? Two laps to go as Kosowski sitting in a good place in the points. Hamlin from fourth is going to take the lead away this time. And he's up to a huge lead and Hamlin will easily lead lap number two. Harvick comes from sixth to second as Kosowski drops multiple positions. One lap to go and he race number four. Harvick and Hamlin side by side. Harvick is going to edge out front as Hamlin puts him in the wall. It doesn't matter though because Harvick still wins here race number 4. Kozlowski drops back to 4th. Both the points leaders are having rough days. Now in the final here race it's going to be Michael McDowell, Chase Elliott, Will Wallace, Chase Briscoe, Joey Logano, and Alex Bowman. Elliott with a slight lead over McDowell in the rest of the field. Oh and Elliott goes hard in the wall. He is up and over. Others behind him crash hard. Joey Logano will lead lap number one, McDowell in second as Alex Bowman in the 48 will DNF. Two laps to go for the final heat race. They're side by side for the lead once again. McDowell edges out front and McDowell will lead lap number two as Logano in the 22 falls back to second. The Fords are dominating this heat race as we have one lap to go now. McDowell with a slight lead once again. And McDowell will win heat race number five. Logano in second advances along with him. Now for the last chance qualifier, it's going to be William Byron, Brad Kozlowski, Todd Gillen, Harrison Byrne, Adrian Allender, and Jace Briscoe. Byron and Kozlowski side by side for the lead. Kozlowski edges up front, but he goes in the wall. Kozlowski is up and over. What a wild ride for Kozlowski in the last chance qualifier, as it looks like Byron and Burton will advance to the next round. Now in the final round, it's going to be Christopher Bell, Michael McDowell, Eric Amarola, Austin Sindrick, Kyle Larson, Joe Lugano, Denny Hamlin, Kevin Harvick, Corey LaJoy, Ricky Stiles Jr., William Byrne, and Harrison Burton. 
They're side by side, coming down the ramp. Christopher Bell's going to edge out front to the lead. Is anyone on the wall behind him? Car spinning all over the place as Christopher Bell will lead lap number one. Eric Amarola in the 10, having a great race in second, as we all have three DNFs. William Byron, Harrison Burton, and Kyle Larson will all DNF. Three laps to go for Martinsville. They're three wide for the lead. Harvick is going to edge out front as Hamlin goes in the wall. He's over once and a half and on his roof. Hamlin goes in the wall and he ramps off the hood of Corey LaJoy. Kevin Harvick leads lap number two with Eric Amarola staying in second. Two laps to go here from Martinsville. Harvick is out to the lead once again over Amarola. Oh, and they go in the wall behind him. Logano and others are up and over. We have cars flipping all over the track as we're going to have two DNFs here. Eric Amarola and Stenhouse. Lugano barely makes it to the line on his roof as Kevin Harvick will lead lap number three with one lap to go. Can Kevin Harvick put his name in the championship mix? They're side by side for the lead. They're going to be side by side coming to the line. Harvick wins it. Harvick will win at Martinsville as he now submits his name into the championship mix. So congrats to Kevin Harvick on his third win of the season. And also congrats to Rowdy Extreme on their third win of the season. Here are the results after Martinsville. Here are the point stands after Martinsville. Tay and Papa now has the lead by four points. And Kevin Harvick's only one point behind Tyler Reddick and Crazy Duck. Only one race left in the Mountain Dew Cup Series. That is going to be exciting. Thank you so much for watching today's race. The championship race for the Mountain Dew Cup Series will be tomorrow at 7.30 Eastern Time. We really hope to see you there for the final race of the season.